Hey guys, welcome to today's video. Today I'm going to be talking about a few favorites I've been loving over the month of July. Either uh, mom favorites, I have some cleaning stuff, some beauty favorites, stuff like that. Uh, William is down here playing, so if you hear some toys or screeches <laughs> or fusses like that, that's what that is. So let's go ahead and dive right in. So the first thing I want to talk about is this, and this is just a hair scrunchie. I've seen these come back over the past few months ago, and I have a really thick, long, not really long anymore, but it's really thick hair. It's heavy, and so like those thin elastics just really always hurt my head. So I thought maybe a scrunchie would be I don't know, just less hurtful on my head. I don't know why I thought that, but it actually really is. It hurts my head a lot less than the normal elastic bands. So if you have really thick hair, try a scrunchie. Usually I just throw mine up on the top of my head because mom life. Um, so if you're doing that every day, I definitely, definitely recommend a scrunchie. I think it works a lot better than the little elastic ties. And they're really cute and um, you can get lots of different colors and prints and patterns and stuff. So I've definitely been enjoying the scrunchie. Next thing I want to talk about are a pair of shoes. And I apologize, they are dirty. I have been wearing them like crazy. Seriously, these are like my summer shoes this year. But they're just a pair of slides from Forever 21. They're that like jelly material that plastic rubber I seriously wear these almost every single day they are perfect for slipping on going outside taking the dog out whatever especially for the beach they're perfect because they can get wet and I just absolutely love them they're just like the perfect shoe if I can find them I'll link them down below I got a pair similar to these last summer and those were like my summer shoe last year I wore those ones non-stop and then I found these and I actually like these a little bit better but the one thing I don't like about them is that the bottoms have this like crossing type action going on and rocks get stuck in them and then poke through this part so you can kind of feel it when you step down so I absolutely hate the bottoms of these shoes I mean you can kind of push the rocks out but still it's super super annoying I wish that the bottoms were different but all in all I still wear these shoes literally every single day. I absolutely love them. Next thing I want to talk about has to do with cleaning and that is microfiber towels. I recently just got some microfiber towels. I used to use either paper towel, which is super wasteful, or just regular like washcloth type cloths. And those did an okay job of cleaning. That's what I been using for the past couple years but honestly they don't do a great job of actually picking up the dust and I found that microfiber towels do such a better job at picking up dust debris stuff like that and sticking to the cloth they're super easy to clean you can just throw them in the cloth the cloth the wash so if you don't have microfiber towels for cleaning I definitely definitely recommend investing in some they're fairly inexpensive I got a pack of like 10 for five dollars off amazon so they're super super inexpensive and i really think they make a huge difference in the cleaning game next thing i want to talk about is a lip combo i've been wearing non-stop this is something that is an oldie but a goodie for me. This has my, been my go-to lip color combo for a really long time. And I recently just uploaded, actually it was the last video I uploaded, which was my Get Ready With Me date night. I used this combination. I got a couple questions about it. So I wanted to kind of do a little bit in more depth about these two lip products because they are seriously amazing and especially amazing together. They work great. So the first one is by Anastasia and it is their liquid lipstick in Pure Hollywood. It is just the absolutely perfect beautiful nudie pink shade. I absolutely love the color of this and the formula of the Anastasia liquid lipsticks are some of my favorites. They're not drying at all. They last for a really long time. She has a huge variety of colors and I just I absolutely love the Anastasia liquid lipsticks. So that is what I put on the bottom and then on top of it I put the Buxom lip gloss in White Russian which is a cult classic. Everyone loves this lip gloss and for a good reason but when you put it on top of the Anastasia um, Pure Hollywood. It's just a match made in heaven. The two complement each other so, so nicely. It's just such a beautiful lip combo. And these are great colors because they're great together, but they're also great on their own. The Buxom Gloss, you could throw over any liquid lipstick and look beautiful. Today, I just have the Buxom Gloss on with nothing else, and I think it looks really, really nice. Both these lip products are amazing together and separately. I absolutely love them. If you like nudes, definitely, definitely check these guys out. Next, we want to talk about is by OPI, and this is called their Start to Finish Base Coat and Top Coat and Strengthener. This is just a clear polish. What I like about this is it is a base coat and a top coat in one so you don't need two separate polishers. Polishers? 
polishes. They also say it's a strengthener. Honestly, I haven't noticed it strengthening my nails too, too much, so I'm not sure about that claim. But as a top coat and a base coat, I think this works really, really nicely. I had been on the hunt for a base coat for a really long time. I struggle with chipping nails like super, super soon after I do them like within 24 to 48 hours. So I knew that a base coat was probably a good idea to look into. Hopefully that that would make my nail polish last a bit longer. And this one, it definitely, definitely does. I get much more wear time out of my polish when I use this. I definitely recommend this if you're looking for a good base coat and a good top coat. I love that it is a two-in-one. This one is definitely a must-have for me. The last two things I have to share with you guys are too big to actually fit in the screen. So I'm just going to kind of talk about them. And of course, I'll link them down below and I'll put pictures in and all that stuff. But the first thing I want to mention is, I think it's just called a play pin. It's basically just a big plastic area that all links together and it's like just a big play pin that you can put him in. And I know a lot of people use baby gates and that's great if that works for you, but the way that my house is set up, baby gates would not work in my house. It just, the areas are too big that the areas I want to keep him out of, if that's making any sense at all. So I wanted to get something that I could just put him in and then I could leave him for, you know, a minute or two and not worry about him getting into the dog food, the dog water, him grabbing cords or any of that stuff. So we found this playpen on Amazon. It was a little bit pricey, but I think it's totally worth it to be able to put him in a place and I know he's going to be safe in there for a few minutes. So we've absolutely been loving that. It is a little bit big. It does take up quite a bit of room in our living room, but I mean, baby stuff is big and it does take up a lot of room. So I'm not super upset about that. I actually just uploaded a vlog where I unboxed that and put it all together. If you guys want to see that video, I'll link it down below, but I definitely recommend it. I think it's great. It's really sturdy so he can actually climb up on it and it's not... So he can actually climb up on it and it's not going to like tip over or anything like that. So I definitely recommend it. I think it is a great, great little playpen. And the last thing I want to talk about is Amazon subscribe and save. I don't know if I have been living under a rock, but I just recently found this. It's seriously saving us so much money. I found his diapers, formula, dog food, um, toilet paper. <laughs> any household item that you would need, you can subscribe to on Amazon and every single month they will send you that pack of diapers, that pack of formula or whatever and it gets you a discount. And what's great about it is if you get five or more items shipped to you each month and you get an even bigger discount. So I think the normal discount is 5%, which isn't huge, but it'll still save you some. And then if you have five or more items, you get a 15% discount. And I know it still doesn't seem that much, but everything adds up. Those dollars that you are saving will definitely, definitely add up. So I'm really, really happy that I found this. Even on his formula alone, I think we're saving over $50 a month on formula, which is absolutely huge. We don't have a Target or a Walmart close to us, so the closest grocery store, the one that we shop at, is Safeway, so things are always a little bit more expensive there. But I even compared the prices to Target prices, which are even cheaper than the Safeway prices, and Amazon still beat those prices. So definitely check out Amazon Subscribe and Save if you haven't already. I don't know if everyone knows about this, but I seriously just found it, and I do not know how we lived without it because it's amazing. And plus, it's less groceries you have to carry from your car you know into the house um, it's free shipping you really have absolutely nothing to lose all right well that wraps up my favorites for the month of July I hope you guys enjoyed thank you guys so much for watching please consider subscribing before you leave I upload every Tuesday and Friday and I'll see you guys in the next one bye guys